What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? It is your host with the most R for 98. And as you guys can see, today we have another Canada Goose jacket from our friends over at China. Now it is getting crazier and crazier, and here we are in 2023 with a brand new version of the Macmillan Parka in its black label form. And we're gonna take a look at all of the details in this six minute video. So hopefully you guys will enjoy. Make sure to like the video if you do. But anyways guys, let's get straight into the video. You guys can see the inside. We have the brand new 2023 black shiny material on the inside. And if you go to the Canada Goose website, even the pictures of the authentic thing does not have this shiny inside even though if you order from canada goose it will actually come like this now that is a big question that i've always asked myself how can china actually get this correct even if canada goose can't even get their own pictures correct now it is crazy to see because canada goose is the biggest jacket selling brand that is out there and i mean china they actually perfected it this time around so this is the macmillan parka a lot of you guys actually wanted me to do a video of it so here it is in a black label form so here you can see the outer material being very nice and very hard making it kind of water and wind resistant so i really like that on some cheaper replicas it had a soft outer material so this jacket that you're seeing definitely looks a lot better uh, especially from a distance i mean you can see here the outer material basically gives the jacket its shape um it eases out with the stitching everything just makes it look more premium if you had used a more soft outer material it wouldn't look right but this definitely looks like a canada goose jacket i mean you can tell from quite a distance and inside here on the pockets you have a super soft black label exclusive kind of material which i really like and uh, we also did see that in the newest vests from china and the newest uh, windham parkas and so on so it's nice to see that they finally did bring it to the macmillan parka uh, here you can see on the bottom we have this kind of section that actually separates the most bottom part of the jacket uh, i mean this thing is looking beautiful on the inside you can see this new black label kind of shiny material uh, here we have the labels here we have the sizing and everything like that so let me tell you something this seller is super nice they are called soplock we've done so many different videos of bags and jackets and belts and whatnot uh, so they are basically legit but what i wanted to say is always contact the seller before ordering anything and that goes with any kind of seller that you're going to order from so make sure to contact these guys tell them what you're looking for make sure to ask for real pictures make sure to give them your height and your weight this way they actually know which size to get for you uh, because on this one i have a extra large even though i am 175 centimeters and 82 kilograms so usually i might use a regular large or sometimes even a medium but this thing comes with a extra large size now i'm not really sure if it's just this specific macmillan parka that i have in my hands or if it's all of the macmillan parkas from this factory but anyways guys looking at the stitching looking at the zipper i mean everything is just put together very very well you can see this ykk zippers now a lot of people when they are checking if it's real or fake they look at if it's a ykk zipper if it has the right logo i mean those are very easy things to replicate the zipper you order it you put it on anything you can say it has a ykk zipper the logo it's a one dollar item on ebay so what i'm trying to say is you have to look at the overall look of the jacket how is the actual outer material that is actually surrounding the entire jacket that is one big factor is it really filled with real down feeling does the jacket keep you warm does it look nice and puffy is the actual proportions of everything nice and correct to actually be looking like a macmillan parka does it have the right amount of sections on the back and on the front and the thing that's separating them in between i mean there's so many things to look for when you want an item to actually look authentic and let me tell you guys this thing actually nails it i mean i can't see any flaw whatsoever on this specific replica let me know if you have a authentic macmillan parka or if you actually can see any flaw whatsoever but as far as i've seen it and i've compared it to the real thing i can't find any flaw whatsoever um even soplock themselves they did actually compare it in a video with a real one 
and the, i mean it is crazy to see guys but these replicas are basically identical sometimes even better with the first and stuff like that but talking about the first this thing does not have a zipper for the first so a macmillan parka can never have a fur just so you guys know that but anyways guys that's gonna be it for today's video nice and short hopefully you guys enjoyed it make sure to subscribe and let me know what you think and again thank you so much for watching i will try and upload more frequently but anyways that's gonna be it for today's video i will catch you guys in the next one peace out guys